According to our battle, debate is a learning tool through which people can learn more about what they know, learn from their opponents and learn to prepare to oppose people and also to defend themselves. An argument is part of a debate. A debate is argument as well as putting forth your views and points. Argument is just about putting forth your views or points. Debate is the process of listening to other people's points of views and argument as well as putting forth your argument as well as your views. So debate is more holistic and more complete whereas argument is just a part of it. Argument itself is not debate, but debate has arguments. Arguments are defense of what you believe or what you have to say or what you stand for. Whereas debate is the complete process of understanding an issue from all sides. Debate actually happens first within a person. Unless you know the art of debating within yourself, you won't be able to debate anybody else. Even before you debate with another external person, you debate with yourself for everything. That is how you make decisions, you plan the course of action, you try to see what needs to be done next, and you also see whether you are right or wrong. This is the debate that helps you to further yourself, to act, to conclude. Debate actually makes you know how much you know and know how much you don't know. It is a process of exploration. It makes you have a better perspective of your own understanding. If it's actually done properly, you will become a good learner because you would know more than how much you know about how much you don't know and how much the others know and how much you have to learn from others. Sometimes you may know a lot but you may not be able to express it. Somebody else may know little but they may actually express it better or see a lot of things. And also debate is uh, explorative uh, that you provoke your opponent and you get the best out of them and you provoke yourself and you get the best out of yourself and somebody else provokes you and the best comes out and debate helps you to look at things from all sides so if you are used to unilateral thinking uh, it uh, helps you to look at things in a multilateral manner and it also helps you to have a better idea of things and you would be able to improve your perspective because you get used to looking at things in a 360 degree manner and that really should help you in your life and in developing your skills of thinking like developing uh, lateral thinking, analytical thinking, critical thinking and so on. So debate helps you in so many different ways and debate helps you to learn things on your own because it can create so many personalities or aspects within yourself. You can discuss and debate and you can also come to conclusions and you can come up with more questions in trying to understand an issue in many more ways than one. Debate is not about proving a point. It's actually the ability to see that whether you can defend anything or you can counter anything. Why do you defend and counter anything? It is basically to see that whether what you know is right or whether you don't know something that is right. It is basically to understand most about something from all sides. It is exploring. If at all you're just trying to prove a point, you're just talking to yourself. The whole process of debating should be that somebody else should be able to question you, should dissect you, should analyze you, should critique you should be able to make you feel so exposed that you feel that you need to know more to defend what you know and at the same time to make you feel that maybe you actually don't know as much as you think you know. So debate is more of a learning process than a process of defending what you believe or a process of uh, uh, putting forth your point. Somebody who can provoke a process of thought somebody who can provoke and get the best answers, somebody who can provoke an exploration of ideas and knowledge is an effective debater. Your questions and your arguments should be able to bring out the best from your opponent and in the process it should bring out the best from inside yourself too. 
that is when you are a good debater there are so many things for instance in verb battle there are so many points that you need to keep in your mind before you think of winning verb battle debate is not just about argument it's also about listening to your opponents it's also about putting forth your ideas by defending even the most inane things with your intelligence with your knowledge to be able to see that anything is defensible and anything is indefensible too it is basically the process of exploration of all sides to an issue so any candidate who argues by giving the kind of a picture to the audience that everything can be examined from all sides is a person who actually stands the best chance to win and you also have to be a nice person we don't want to listen to arguments from obnoxious people we want nice people to be speaking in a nice way and making us understand you could be provoking but provocation should be positive too if anybody does that kind of a provocation then i think that's also important in getting somebody to win but ultimately it's about your arguments how best you defend yourself how best you counter the opponent how best you convince the judges in verb battle it's mostly about the impression that candidate or the participant has on the judges than specifically about the debates because we are not having debates by machines or by robots the debate is between people so there is no scientific uh, metrics about how much and what was working on the judges it's about the sum total of the effect of an argument uh it is how sometimes a judge is personally touched why are we making it so academic ultimately people get convinced sometimes uh even about some very stupid simple inane things and sometimes they don't get convinced even if you're giving them the best or even the most uh, well rounded sound arguments so it's about how somebody got impressed and if somebody got impressed that must have been done in a very effective way so the person who does that kind of impression is considered the winner first of all uh, judges wait to see whether the candidate is uh, a learner a listener is an examiner an analyst a student first of all the debater has to be a human being should believe that he is like anybody else actually just like anybody else he is not superior to anyone he is not inferior to anyone if he knows the best about something there is somebody else who knows the best about something else so it's about contributory learning so if somebody shows that that he has the ability to learn has the patience to listen to another person has the dignity to respect his opponent i think that itself makes him a better person a lot of judges mark these kind of students higher than students who sound obnoxious full of themselves and suffering from self importance ultimately the judging is done with marks but we don't actually get the judges to Uh, very strictly go by marks basically we say you quantify your impression by way of marks so if you feel that something is higher you mark it higher if at all you don't think it's higher and it's lower you mark it lower it's ultimately about uh, what the judge actually feels is the right quantification of the impression but you can't say that you know i mean this is quarter marks more and you know half mark less because you can't exactly say that unless you can actually defend it by saying that's exactly your impression that it's neither quarter marks more or half mark less and that is how you mark it we have been conducting verb battle competitions for a long time and 2016 is the 12th edition of verb battle competitions in india particularly in karnataka we want verb battle to grow far and wide and uh, we want the message of our battle to reach more people we want people to become more democratic in their thinking in their attitudes in their behavior in their lifestyle in their life itself we want verb battle to bring about a positive change in the society and particularly we want verb battle to make our children better positive and productive